Hi, today I'll be talking about the different modalities of treatment of acne. Acne is commonly called pimples. The common man know it, knows it as pimples and it's a very very common problem which generally occurs in everyone. Now pimples or acne is very common during the adolescent period and you know certain patients come to us with a severe degree of pimples going to a certain extent that the entire face is involved. Now what are the common causes of pimples? Invariably pimples occurring in the adolescent period is due to a hormonal imbalance and the people and the children or the teenagers will grow out of it. So not much of treatment is required in the initial stages. The treatment could be just symptomatic where in which you know we try to decrease the cause of these pimples. Now commonly if we need to know what has to be done we should know why it occurs and basically pimples is nothing but a swelling of the sebaceous glands which generally occurs during adolescence. So now once the gland is swollen the content within the gland is called the sebum and the sebum is unable to come out to nourish the hair follicle in the skin. So in such conditions the patient develops these swellings throughout the face and the result is pimples. So commonly these pimples can be treated very well. Initial stages we give agents like ointments which can decrease the production of the sebum and decrease the inflammation surrounding the gland which is inflamed. Once we try with these medications then we, we, we start the second line of medications where in which we are actually decreasing the production of sebum itself. So there are beautiful medicines that are now available for the treatment of pimples. Now for people who have residual pimples even when they grow out of adolescence now then we have to look at the cause why these people are developing these things and invariably there's a lot of stress there's a lot of strain and there's a lot of nutritional abnormalities which can cause these pimples. Now coming to people who have scars related to these pimples. Now these you know these type of people we cannot give tablets or ointments to decrease these scars. We'll have to do something more aggressive and a little deeper. For such patients we have beautiful chemical peels and we have the fractional CO2 laser treatments. Now there are a lot of people who have very very deep pitting scars due to pimples and these are the individuals that will very benefit with a combination of PRP injections, fat injections and fractional CO2 laser. Thank you.